This is going to be a quick product review of the Murray's Gel Lock Lock. Now this product cost me $3.79. I stumbled across this product while I was walking through my local beauty supply store. And as you can see from the texture of this product, it's very gel-like with no particular smell. Now, I stumbled across this product and I said, hey, this looks like Kinky Curly. And as you can see from the texture of Kinky Curly, it's very wet, kind of drippy, but it's not as thick as the Murray's Gel Lock Lock. So, I decided to purchase the product anyway. So I'm going to apply this product to my hair because it is pH balance. I tested it. I'm going to use the Afro G Leave-In Reconstructor. And this is my set look. My set look is no different than how I will usually set my hair for a twist out. According to the Murray's Gel Lock Lock. It said it should be applied to sections prior to braiding or twisting. For best results, finish style with a warm dryer. Okay, so this is the next day and it's pretty well defined. I cannot believe that it's kind of tightly coil for some reason in the back my hair just do not curl up like I like it to but um let's swing around in the back and see how it looks what I find very interesting with this product is that I did not set my hair no different than how I will usually set my hair. The Murray Gel Lock Lock gave me a different curl pattern than if I was to set my hair with Kinky Curly. Again, the product only cost me $3.79 and I must say overall, I like it. It gave me a different look. Thanks for viewing this video.